Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of Jurassic World Evolution 2! How are you guys doing today? I hope you're doing very, very well. Now, I know what you lot are probably thinking. Tony, where is the rest of your Medium series? Now, the thing is with that one, right guys? Um, I have about six to eight hours of streaming videos of the Medium to go through. And to go through them and get a medium video out at this point in time is currently time consuming for me because um we've we've taken my child uh, we've taken the children to school making sure there's some content for, um, for you guys to enjoy and helping my, helping my wife with a project which all will be revealed in the new year so keep your eyes peeled for that but i just haven't got i haven't got enough time at the moment to sit through eight hours worth of stream files and find a video for you guys so this is why instead i've opted for jurassic world evolution 2 because well i enjoy the game i like dinosaurs I'm a very huge dino nerd as you heard me explain in the first video and um yeah let's just get on with today's video shall we now we've got two carnotauruses coming here so we'll put one there one there now if you remember from the second video which is obviously the last video I'd also um, a close eye on these they love their sand they settle into their surroundings so we're Whatever just gonna they've had a taste of the wild chuck the whole enclosure in sand well okay we make no assumptions and pay attention to all the details good Remember, then obviously we like want us, a live prey feeder, which will go here. We need to keep that in mind um, as you build another dinosaur habitat. Hmm, we'll have a, a viewing gallery and us. there as get well. Built, then get the dinosaurs into the new enclosure. And that about covered us. Perfectly. We'll give them a little a little lake to drink out of as well. Put that around there. That should be fine. Do we have a rain uh, do we have a ranger? That's the arrival. But, ah, here we go. Here we go. Right, response team. Here we go. Just going to go straight into this. Uh, yeah, let me know, guys, right, that... <coughs> Sorry about that. Let me know if you are enjoying the series. Just chuck a comment down below. Yeah, let me know if you're enjoying it, if anything needs to be changed, how it can be changed, and if there's anything I can do to make the content a bit better well yeah if there's anything i can do to make the content a lot better for you guys to enjoy because as i say to everyone feedback is really a pre uh you know i appreciate any sort of feedback yeah if there's any you know uh, I can I can handle constructive criticism, you know, if anyone if you guys want to criticize something that maybe I could do better or if I've done wrong, don't be just don't be afraid to um to drop a comment. Cuz I'm not going to be one of these types that are going to be like, "Oh, you don't know what you're talking about. This is my, you know, this is my channel, my gameplay. I play it how I want." I'm not I'm not going to be that sort of person. I'm not because I just think, you know, that's a bit bang out. That's a bit bang out of all. Do you know? At the moment, at the moment, I'm doing this as a hobby. It's a hobby I enjoy, and at the same time, I want to make it enjoyable for everyone else. Now we've got to build another enclosure here because we have an Allosaurus dropping into the park. I'm not sure how many it's going to. be evolution 2 oh no we only have one allosaurus all right so one allosaurus I'm may as well sure do I'll never be fully comfortable at the park but the lab right, let's uh, make sure the dinosaurs are so take more trees <laughs> that's out a job you should stay on top of because I need to oh before I forget I've got to put uh, I got to put a gate in I need to put a gate in. I've got to be careful because money's becoming tight now. Put a gate in there. A steady supply of dinosaurs to our control center. 
Now that I like. We'll put the ankylos. From possible uncontrolled interaction with the general public. Right here. hundred percent win in my book. Now to the bad news, which I always hate getting, but honestly, kind of enjoy giving. <laughs> These animals are arriving with an unknown disease, and we've got to get a handle on it post haste. That's management that speaker should. PDQ, huh? Pretty now I reiterate, that should Dr. be big Hewitt? enough for the ankylos. We can diagnose this disease with scans from our mobile veterinary unit. We'll get it under control before too long. That's good. Right, we'll put the Let's gate there. Put a quick viewing gallery in as well. Oh no! Wait, this side. Yeah. Put it there. Right, the ankylos are coming. They are coming. Drop one there, one there. Just quickly. Direct control with you. Here they come. I'm not sure if this is big enough for them. I don't know, I may have to go a little bit longer. But we will find out now. Come on, oh one. Check finished. Check complete. Right, let's see. Oh no, they could have enough. Right, they need ground leaf and ground fruit. So is there ground fruit right ground leaf let's yeah I'm gonna have to go bigger yep yeah, yep yeah, I'm gonna have to go bigger here so um let's just quickly cut that out now then Demolish, demolish. We will eventually know they have bigger open space. Yeah, see, look, they're noticing now. Right, ground, what else is ground fruit? Just you. I'll put the ground fruit. You have to understand something. Owen and I signed on to this project because we want what is best All right, for so the we've got dinosaurs. to research it now. Not for them um, to be exploited or engineered, hacked and spliced. What and one is it? compromised they deserve a it's chance at life as much as any other living creature honestly perhaps even more as the miracle of science gave them a second chance so well, hopefully i pronounced research, it right find the cure and then let's use it the dinosaurs die again and listen that's well, not so we got a minute hour for this so let's just speed this up we'll speed it up so we can get this done quicker yeah, we know about diseases, don't worry. Oh no, even the Carno's got it now. Right, they're all ill. Right, ground fibre they're missing. So they're missing forest and ground fibre. So forest. That's all fibre, ground fibre, ground fibre. Right, let me put this in. There we are. We'll put the forest in. Forest light. Oh, wait, no. What am I doing? I can't be blocking off the gate. Put it like... Because when they come over here, they'll see it anyways. So then what we'll do is, yep, yeah, water. I can go there, like that, and then whack a quick viewing gallery down here. Like that, quick path. Don't hate on the way I make paths, by the way, please. Right, one. Another one there. Oh, wait. 
wait, hang on. Fuel. Fill up. Speed it up. I think we got Parasaurolophuses in here as well, haven't we? Uh, where are they? Yeah, right, what disease? The common cold. Do I not have... Do I have that researched? They got the common cold. Right, so my Taurosauruses have uh, contracted COVID-19. These Parasaurolophuses can live in here. Why are you going down to 98 Comfort? You want more ground leaf? Taking a Michael, aren't you? Got enough ground leaf, ain't you? There you go. There's plenty more of it. Speed up quickly. We gotta get the three thousand rating. We're just like nine hundred and twenty-five off now. Yeah, because uh, I'm going by here, right? Look, their likes. Oh no, it's the Pachycephalosaurus. What about the Taurosaurus? Can you cohabitate with anyone? The Ankylos. Are you serious? One evaded. I got four. I've got an idea. Let me... Uh... Right, sorry about that, guys. It wasn't uh, a technical malfunction. My cat decided to stand on top of my keyboard and finish the recording. So... Hats off to Chelsea for doing that one. Thanks, mate. Uh, right. I'm trying to do this as quick as I can, so then um, I can go and pick the kids up from school. You need resupplying, so we'll resupply you. I'm going to put the Sinoceratops in here anyway, see what they do. There we go. Many of these dinosaurs are naturally aggressive, especially the predators. Oh, they can live we with... We don't uh... encourage this aggression. Unless we can study it, that is. Oh, wait. They're fighting? Territory! Oh, wow, we lost. Yeah, I knew it. I knew it. Quick. I don't even know what these not need at the moment. Oh god. Yeah, SNC that's Sinoceratops, Sinoceratops, Sinoceratops. Oh my god, they're attacking the vehicle! Give it to me. I'm a better driver. Open the gate. Open the gate. Check me out. My Tokyo Drift. Ding, 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 ding. Oh, we can do a patrol, right? A missing ground fiber? How much? That's the Ankylo. And Forest! Oh my god. Hang on. Because I can't be asked to sedate. I cannot be bothered to sedate them. <clears throat> And move him again.
So I'm just going to make the enclosure even bigger. The forest down to here. Well, we're going to see if we can quickly do this with two baryonyxes. So let's get a, a very, very quick enclosure made. It made there. Uh, need another. I, I, I want another one of these. Yeah, I want. A, I want another one of these. I'm gonna have to put. We only got one baryonyx. One is all we need, though. That'll do. And then Ranger Team Two at task. Get you. Oh, it's rock, 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 rock. Baryonyx loves some rock. Is it rock or stone? Oh no, it's definitely rock. Forest. His mission, mission, mission. He's missing water and fish. See, right. So, uh, there's some water going on here. Loves his water. Look at the fish, right there. And we're gonna go back. Whoops. There we go. When you broke out! Whoa! Whoa! What's my man doing breaking out? I can't believe that. Are you telling me this is not enough? Come on, mate. Look, the Sinnohs are happy. Everyone's happy, mate. Come on. What's next? Marasaurus, a Brachiosaurus. Come on, bro, really? Diplodocus, Dionicus. Ay, oh, come on, man, this ain't fair. Asmosaurus. I'm gonna have to do this one. I'm just gonna build. A, uh, I'm just gonna build another enclosure. Get this over and done with. Quick enclosure time. Okay. Well, I don't know. There. Yes. Yes. Wait. What? Just what? All this for what? Nah. I'm going here with them. Wait. Don't go anywhere. There he is. There he is. There he is. Status update. Check complete. No, there's an issue. There's an issue. Tranquilize. What's he like, anyways? Ground leaf. Oh, he can go in with. Yes, okay, he can go in with okay. the ankylos. We're making progress, but there's always more to be done. For you, anyway. <laughs> Take He's going in with the Ankylos. Come on, how hard is it? Thank you. You can go in here. Right, so you're missing forest. And ground leaf. And obviously, the natural habitat of water. Here we go. 
I can't believe this poor old bugger's got to live by himself. Look at him. Fifteen seconds left. Let's go. That's Pennsylvania done. This is what we'd hoped to accomplish on Isla Nublar. A place where the dinosaurs could finally thrive. Minus the volcano. Obviously. That's a pretty big minus. I think we can all be proud of what we've accomplished here. But? But what? I can hear it in your voice. Okay, okay. I'm just wondering what Dua is really up to. I don't buy all her saving the future by controlling the past talk. Yeah, Lambert mentioned that some of the animals were being moved to an undisclosed location. He wouldn't say, or maybe he didn't know who was taking delivery, but it wasn't the DFW third party and you and I are not invited first reports were from Seattle Tacoma Airport's air traffic control but now we're getting radar hits from Portland International so they're traveling south probably because of the weather agreed they're migrating but what happens if one of these animals decides to play chicken with a commercial airliner this is the modern world and the prehistoric one on a collision course. All right then, guys. Anyways, that is going to be the end of the episode here. If you did enjoy it, please make sure you subscribe and like the video. It's completely free. And remember, this is all about you guys, not just about me. It's about you. So remember, please like, please subscribe. Let me know in the comments if there's anything that I can do to improve the videos, make the content look better. Just let me know. And with that being said, keep smiling, stay positive, and peace.